welcome back to the channel. So today, coming at you from Evans Campground. Uh, this is somewhere around the town of Evans, Washington. Um, sits right on the Columbia River, um, Lake Roosevelt recreation area, actually. Um, this is a paid location. It's about $24 per night. Um, you know, so if that's your thing, here it is. Um, nice scenic views. You know, I've been really, really enjoying my time here. Um, take you around for a campground tour and show you what's going on. And then we have a fun little experiment that we're going to try too. Um, finally started getting some nice sunny weather. So we're actually going to try to use this you may recognize this this is the bag that came with this the shower so I'm actually gonna fill this up with water fairly early today um, and then I'm gonna go set it out in the sunshine today and see if this black bag is actually set up to you know thermal or solar heat water however you want to call it and we're going to basically try to use the sun to warm up the water so that way we don't have to use a stove when i go to have our shower tonight and hopefully it will be glorious so get you get the water filled up and get you on a site tour and then we'll check out the water later today
let that sit like that, I guess. See what happens. All right, so for the site tour, nothing too special this weekend. Got a hammock set up. Uh, got a couple of naps in there. And we got the van parked over here. There's a picnic table over here. Got the quick set set up over here. I haven't really made use of this at all this weekend. I think I sat in there like one time. And then got a fire ring there. Of course, we are still under stage two fire restrictions, which means I can't even use my trigger. Over across the way there, got the bathroom. It actually has flushing toilets and running water, so that's been kind of nice. And then over there on the other side of Mom and Scott's trailer, there is a water spigot for potable water. All right, I'm going to take a check on the temperatures of the water that's been sitting out in this bag all day. See how it looks. Yeah. Well, it's definitely not hot. It's not even really warm, but it's warmer than it was when it came out of the spigot, so I don't know. Well, so I'm pretty well packed up. About ready to head out here before too long. Just got a couple of things to tidy up on in the van and be ready to rock and roll out of here. So the, <laughs> the water from yesterday, um, kind of backfired on me just a little bit yes. yeah so it wasn't up to temperature and that you know is what it is you know it's like oh, okay well I guess we'll just heat it up you know the old-fashioned way and so I got some water out of it to start my heat up process and was just starting to get the shower enclosure thing set up and poof fall over goes the water pail that bag it just I don't know it I don't know I set it down and it was stable when I set it down because I kind of played with it a little bit to make sure it wasn't gonna go anywhere and it decided to go somewhere anyway and I went all over the floor of my van um, luckily I had the shower enclosure at least laid out because um, you know probably two-thirds three-quarters of the water or so I guess ended up inside of that so it wasn't quite as much to mop up as what there would have been if I hadn't gotten that far so I'm at least thankful for that so I think if I'm gonna use that black bag for water um, it's probably gonna be when I have an outdoor area set up for showers not something I'm apt to do at a big public campground like this one is but um, you know boondocking I might set up a outside location to shower and you know because it is nice to have separate spaces you know I, I do like having the Mojix thing for inside the van for you know when I need it inside the van um, but otherwise I'll probably just set up my showers outdoors for the most part but So that is that. Well, I hope you enjoyed this weekend's or this week's video. However, I don't know. I'm trying to think about how, you know, what are some things I can do to um you know, try to keep some content going on the channel because, you know, ideally I would like to get stuff up every week, but I'm not going anywhere every week, so you know, I can't showcase something every week i mean next week i'm going to my folks house again um actually got some projects to work on so you know at least we'll have that but you know when there's no projects or no travel you know what are some things you guys might want to see i mean i i i don't know um maybe 
just what talk about stuff I don't know I don't know anyway again hope you enjoyed this week's video if you did uh, please go ahead and consider subscribing if you're not um, hit the bell icon for notifications uh, thumbs ups all that wonderful stuff every little bit helps and costs you nothing so um, thank you so much again for watching have a nice day